Hello everyone, my name is Anton and today I'm going to show the OneNote app working on the Max Lumi. This has been a one really big request from a lot of the, the users in the comments and I figured I'd go ahead and do a video that's specific to the OneNote application on this device. So I'm in the apps section here. I'm going to go ahead and click on OneNote. I've already downloaded it from the Google Play Store. And this is the experience you get basically right out of the box. And we can see here, as shown in another video, that um, some of the Microsoft apps come up with the the background and some of the text and just the, you know, the look and feel of the app may not be um, as user friendly as it should be and some of this can be tweaked a little bit if we go into the settings here for the app optimization so i'm going to go ahead and go into app optimization for OneNote. and one of the main things that typically has a drastic result when you make the change is changing the whiting app background here so i'm going to go ahead and turn that off and immediately we can start seeing some of the background here of the top toolbar. And I'm going to leave it there for now. I won't change anything else. I think this here is adequate. Um, as we move forward, I will go ahead and change the app speed so we can see how changing the app feed speed here within OneNote um, either makes the writing experience better or worse. Okay. So right now I can now see again the, the menu. This is the, the mobile app that for Android. So it's going to look and feel similar to uh, what it would look like on your phone or on your Android device. So if I go ahead and let me go into home here and go into draw, we can see we have the pins here. And if I pull out my pen, and go ahead and select one of the options here. Let's say this option here looks like it will be good here. The colors obviously will not show as color because we're on an e device. But let's see how the writing experience is on this. So one thing you just noticed is the palm rejection is not as good here. As soon as I rested my palm on the device, it started to kind of move the uh, the canvas around here a bit. But let's go ahead and do some writing here. Now you can see how there's considerable lag as I'm writing. You basically do not see what you're writing as you're writing it and you're going to have to trust that it will catch up and everything that you've written is what you want to write. But here we have this is me on the Max Lumi. You can see here the H and the E did not um, get written pro uh, properly there. Now let me go ahead and change the speed. We're basically going, going to go from the slowest speed up to the max. And let's see how this performs. First off, we can see that there's a ghosting already. And that's typical with having it in that max speed. The refresh doesn't happen um, as often and you get ghosting. Okay, so here is me writing in the max speed. You can see it seems like it's pretty much the same um, amount of lag as it is in the slow speed. Uh, me, I can't really tell too much of a difference. So it is really, really, really slow. The lag is unusable in my opinion. And for those out there that want to kind of see an example, I think everyone is kind of optimistic that OneNote, which is a fabulous application on other dividing devices, writing devices, 
is not that optimized for the max looming. So you, if you buy this device specific with the needs um, of using OneNote, you're going to be greatly disappointed. So for now, that's pretty much it. I just want to show the, again, the writing experience here. We can do this a little bit in slow motion. You can see how that lag there is going. And this is in the fast speed. And if I go ahead and go back to the slow speed again, and I'll do it slowly here, draw the line. You can see that it's pretty much the same. It's not too much improvement and it doesn't get much worse when you change it from optimized or the max speed to the slow speed. Ho hopefully this helps people out there understand how OneNote works on the Max Lumi. It's the same experience on the Nova 2 as well. So I would say most of the Onyx line, you're going to get the same type of experience in OneNote. Okay, so if that was informative, that helped you out, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and have a good day.